Hey everyone, Sean Clement here, Wisdom in Golf, headquarters at Richmond Hill Golf Learning Center in Richmond Hill, Ontario. I don't do product reviews very often, but when I do, it's because it's worth mention, okay? This one here is a really cool product. Let me show you something really neat here. This is a new German product uh, called xmike.de, that's the website, so x dash mic. Notice there's no grooves on this thing, okay? And it is a gorgeous muscle back blade. Now, the, um, the steel that they use in this particular club, and also, while you're here, Matt, look at the shaft. There's actual hickory in this shaft. There's graphite, hickory, and steel on the bottom, very much like those uh, matrix shafts that Bubba Watson uses. So you get some really good torque on the bottom. And then there's a medium weight and a very interesting kick to the shaft when you're, when you're hitting with it. And I've, I've just been nutting it in the center of the club face with all of these. And contrary to popular belief, you don't lose spin. So the feel that you get out of the shaft is like I've never felt before. And by the way, I'm going to go on record right now that I would easily play with these clubs. Okay. The, um, the, 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 the contact through the golf ball is absolutely terrific. Nice ball flight. It flies just like my Nike clubs, okay? So I'm basically getting the same distance, maybe a smidge more. Maybe the, the lofts are a little bit beefier than what I have on my blades. But I can tell you that three iron, just a pure feel on, on the club face and it's, it makes it that much easier. It's just a little lighter than a regular steel shaft. It's got a really nice kick to it, but it feels very responsive. And the, uh, the feel on the club face itself and the sound that it makes is tremendous. It's really, really excellent. So I see my dandelion stem. It cuts beautifully through the stem, just like regular clubs. You hear the sound of that? Just amazing. Beautiful height. Fantastic spin on the club. And the, um, the wedges that um, that they use, <laughs> really cool. They call them bagger vance wedges. Isn't that awesome? And they won't tell me what steel they use because it's proprietary and it's, uh, it's, a, it's a secret, but it's military grade steel. And um, the shafts again is the same. It's like they use a steel shaft on the wedges because you don't really need the kick in those specialized graphite hickory shafts that they have. But the wedges, just phenomenal. Great bounce on the club. Just a fantastic feel through. And what's really cool too is you get to see the ball print on the face on a regular basis. And that was, that was the lob wedge right there. So if I open up the face, it's got just the perfect amount of bounce. Nice and low, not too high of bounce. So when I'm cutting through the stem for my flop shots, I get this beautiful loft, and I was just hitting some chip shots this morning. You know, typically, if it's not a, a forged club, the ball tends to rocket off the club face. Now, these are not forged, they're, they're cast, but the steel that they're using, I don't know what they're doing, but I don't get any, uh, any hot contact on the chip shot where the ball's just gonna ricochet way past the pin, and I'm getting some terrific spin on, the, on, the, on those short chip shots. So highly recommend the product. Um, you know, if you're in Europe or you want to, you know, order one of these clubs, just order one of them. Get to see how it feels. It's an incredibly unique product. And if you want to be, you know, separate yourself from the crowd and really make people talk, you'll show them, hey, look, I got no grooves and I got plenty of spin. Enjoy. Mm -hmm.